We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the Cincinnati Reds and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Eddie James, the National League's batting leader, continues his campaign for a batting crown. Next. Simeon Woods Richardson, a right-hander from the state of Texas, is the man on the mound here. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Kind of a strange outing in his last one, Matt. Was able to pitch into the sixth inning. Wasn't able to complete the inning. It kind of got away from him in the sixth. It'll be interesting, Matt, to see how he bounces back in this one. So digging in now, Eddie James. He's had a phenomenal year at the plate entering this August contest as the league's batting average leader. I've never been in this position in my career before. I wonder if he's counting games down. You certainly want to walk away at the end come of the year on, with a batting it, crowd. And he's safe. And the streak will continue as he creeps even higher up the all-time list. Hey, now into the 30s, yeah. D-Road. Do you think he starts looking ahead, 100%. thinking about that magic number, maybe getting it to 40? Yeah, I don't think you ever worry about Joe D's number, but when you start climbing into the 30s, man, there's not many guys that have been there. Yeah, this on, is just guys. a steady yeah. diet the of first staying thing. in the zone for over Damn. a month. Rather. Runners are at first and third, one away. Throw over to the bag, no. and he'll dive hey. back in safely. And another throw over. Oh, and he breaks, and they've got him picked off. Thought about going for second, but instead, now they've got him in a pickle. And they'll run him down and tag him for the out. So striding forward now, Jeff Ullman. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The first baseman. That's lifted the other way out to left. James comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. So the next to the plate for Pittsburgh, that Yvonne Herrera. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Yvonne Herrera. Pulls this one in the air out to left. James is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Digging in, Eddie James. He reached on a single in his first try. And the pitch. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And, oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. So that's his second knock of the game, and you can add this to his ever-growing list of multi-hit performances this season. Does this guy ever look bad at the dish? I mean, really doesn't. Fighting for a batting crown, throwing out multi-knock games daily. It's going to be a fight to the finish right here. Here now the 2-2. Hit in the air out to straightaway left. Sharp is there, and he makes the catch for the out. In now, Sheldon Noisy, runner in scoring position with two gone. Sheldon Noisy. Ready with the 0 and 1. Slow little roller to there third. Stand up. Reined stand up. in. Throw up. in time, and the side is retired. One hit, one left. We'll move on to the bottom of inning number three. It's the Reds one, and the Pirates nothing. We're back now as the Pirates line up readies for their third turn with the bats. And unfortunately for them, this club has had their issues on offense. Entering the day, they rank near the bottom of the league in batting average, on-base percentage, and slugging. So it's clear this is a work in progress. One player told me before the game, it's a difficult thing to go through. We're all competitive guys, and we believe in ourselves. But we're obviously not getting the results we need. Now, one coach told me... Into the box the now, team. Eddie James. On, and he's got Where's runners right? at the here corners here with only one gun. Come on, baby, square it up. Hey, get your First pitch of the right at bat there. on its way. This one is crushed. Back, 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 and gone.
So a three-run shot to left center. So he just continues to club the baseball at an alarming rate as this lead swells to seven to nothing. Well, d -Row, you know, they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there. Making his way to the plate, the Eddie field. James. Oh, and we'll see if Eddie. he can get something into the gap yeah. to make it interesting. He's had a great game so far, but needs the get triple out, to complete a cycle. Take a look, we take all a know look. this guy's a real good fastball hitter. We saw how far he could hit one. He got a fastball that he liked. Get down. The throw, and he's tagged out at third. But one run does come in to score on the play. Up next for the Buckos, Kevin Kramer. Been a strikeout victim twice in this one. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. James is there, and he has it for the out. Settling in now, Jairo Munoz. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh Gyro. inning. Munoz. The 1 1 home. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. You, 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 take it here. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Pirates strand a couple. Still way back, it's nine. Stepping in, Eddie James. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, and he certainly got the wheels trying to stretch a double into a triple. But it's sort of a killer to the club when you can't leg it out. And he goes down and gets this fastball and takes it high in the air to deep straightaway center. Lewis is back to the track as he takes it for route number two. Now at the plate, Yvonne Herrera. He flew out in his last at bat. The catcher, Ebon Herrera. Hops this one up. Noisy, ranging got, into the got, outfield. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Yep, just another successful day at the office for these guys. But this one has a little bit of added significance, as that's win number 82 for them on the year. So they're assured of finishing the season with a winning record. 12 to 3 is the way this one ends. The Cincinnati Reds jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Trevor Bauer wins for a league-high 19th time this year. Simeon Woods Richardson couldn't escape the fourth inning as he slapped with the loss. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. And it looks like we'll see a pinch hitter here as he'll come on with the runner at first and two gone in the inning. Your attention, please. Pinch hitting for the oh, red. Seat up, drive right back up the box. Let's go. Eddie. Jay. High in the air and deep to left center field. Lewis looks up. Boom goes the dynamite. So a two-run shot to left center, number 720 for his career. As they will take the lead here, it's now a 5-4 ball game. Well, d -Row, you know they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't. You're Miguel Figueroa place. gets the call from now, the pen to take over. On. <laughs> now the lineup was clicking for him in this contest, and the man you see there was a major contributor. For that, he's the tops player of the game. And he was locked in at the plate up there. Here you now, could really see it in his approach and the swings he put on the ball. For the Finished with three Pirates. base hits, Six and he certainly was a big factor no in their victory. Left nine runners on base. Afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the Cincinnati Reds and the Pittsburgh Pirates. 
Pirates baseball starts right now. Jose Barrios, the right-hander out of Puerto Rico, will be the starter. What do you have for us on him, Danny? One of the things that jumps out, if you look at that stat sheet, a very high whip coming into this start. One of the things he's going to have to do a much better job, keep traffic off the bases, keep the walks down. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Ranging back is Lewis. On the warning track, he makes the catch. One more look at the final out. A teeth rattler if ever there was one. More to come on the show Sunday Baseball after this. Now at the plate, Chris Sharp. He appeared as a pinch hitter in yesterday's contest. The 2-1. Pulls this one in the air out to left. James is going to get there as he backs up to put it away and there are two gone now. Well it's still early but it's also worth noting that he'd be in line for the win if this keeps up as we take a look at the league leaders in games won this season and as you see there he's sitting in second place in the National League in that department. James will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move and that ends the three go the Pirates. They trail this one one to nothing. The left field. Digging in for his second Eddie. at bat, Eddie James. James. He flew out in his last at bat. Bounce towards the second baseman. Scooped up. Throw to first oh. in time. One gone here in the fourth. Now to the plate, Eddie James. He'll lead it off here against field. Jose Barrios. Eddie. Rip James. toward the gap in right. Come on, come on, go, go, go. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. And as you see right there, this streak will continue as he inches forward up the all-time list. And that'll bring in Ramon Laureano. Lifetime against Jose Barrios. It's a big enough sample size, but he's just one for 14. He's also gone down on strikes five times. And this is swung on and missed. And boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. Now back. That call him. Here's a pop-up now. Munoz has to shade his eyes from the sun, but he stays with it for round number two. Digging in once again, Sheldon Noisy. A hit in two tries for him so far. Sheldon Noisy. Here's the 0-2. Now that's popped up. Go hard, score. Ullman you got it. Waits on it. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. One left for Cincinnati. At the plate, Key Brian Hayes. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Key Brian Hayes. Hit high and deep to left field. A ball that's carrying. He's got it as the tying run is left on base. Pirates leave one. They're down 2-1. Digging in, Eddie James. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this AB. This is lined into left field, and he delivers a big base hit. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. He's safe. Well, nice Dero, nice you know, hit. they say records are made to be broken, and what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't begin to tell you as a former offensive player what that means. You want to put biscuits in the basket, run scored in ribbies, run scored in ribbies, and this guy's the best in the business right now. Now batter. Number Striding in once again, and Ramon Laureano. He's 0 for 2 with a walk thus far. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. 
Striding in, Eddie James coming off the clutch two run single his last time up. From the stretch. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Lewis retreats to the track and he'll put this one away. Striding in to start the ninth, Key Brian Hayes. And they'll need him to get something going here. Key Brian. Pulls this one in the air out to left. James is there, and that's not the start to the bottom of the ninth this crowd was hoping for. One away. You might think it's just another win, but it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find a way to get it done, and they should be very happy with this performance. Six to two, the final total today. Cincinnati led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Zach Gallen earns win number 15 on the year. Jose Barrios pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends up taking the loss. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the victorious Cincinnati Reds.